What's up, everybody? Jason's here. Welcome to the episode. Today we're going to talk about how to set up your DID with your A Star S Series Void PBX. First, let's check about the major question we have now. What is DID? DID or Direct Inward Dial is a service offered by the service provider, which allows outside caller to directly reach a certain destination by dialing a special number. It is also known as a DID number. Once someone calls the DID number, the call will be directly sent to the assigned destination. One trunk could hold one general number with multiple DID numbers. With these numbers, we will have direct channels that connect outside callers to the specific destinations in the telephone system, such as to one extension, to group of extension, to a queue, or a conference room. Of course, DID numbers can be only acquired by purchasing from the service provider. That was the basic concept. Let's go into the configuration. Say we've already paid for two DID numbers, triple three, triple four, and triple one, triple zero. Bind with this trunk, digit two E one. Let's have these two DID numbers configuring. We want to use the first number 33444 as the specific number for our international sales team. Before we get started, don't forget to create a ring group for the team. So we will need to make sure that all members of the team will have access to it when a call comes in. Now, get to the call features, find ring group, and create a ring group specifically for the international sales team. If you're not clear about the ring group setups, Subscribe our channel, you could get the video episode for the configuration. Alright, let's get back. We will need to create an inbound route particularly for this DID number. Now, go to the call control, find inbound route, click on add, name it, and choose the trunk from which we obtain this DID number. Then, put the DID number 33444 in DID pattern. After that, Let's choose the international sales team ring group as the destination. Once it has been down, if someone calls him by 33444, the call will go directly to the ring group international sales. All members of the international sales team will be able to receive the call. We can also set specific IVR for the international sales team of course. Choose IVR as the destination and guide the caller to international sales ring group through the IVR. Let's set the DID number 11100. We can bind this number to one specific extension. Now, all we need is to create a specific inbound route for this DID number 11100. Enter the DID pattern. In the destination, choose the extension number you want to assign and select the trunk. Now we will have it. If someone calls in by 11100, the call will be right through to the extension 1000. If we have multiple DID numbers, for example, we bought 30 DID numbers for the E1 line, we need to assign them one by one to 30 extensions. Here's the method we could cut the corner. First, make sure the DID numbers and extension numbers are continuous numbers. Now, create an inbound route for the DID numbers of the E1 line. Put the starting number, hyphen, ending number in the DID pattern. Select the extension range as the destination. Put in the extensions we want to assign, with also starting number, hyphen, and ending number. Just assure that we have included exactly same numbers of DID and extensions. Well now, we have assigned all DID numbers one by one to extensions. Okay, that was how we set DID numbers. Guys, thank you so much for watching. DID settings really practical in our daily working. I really wish this quick guide could help. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit that like button if you like it. Subscribe us if you aren't already. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Twitter. I will see you guys in the next episode.